Hello, everyone. Did you know that the foods you eat every day could be shortening your life? Yes, that's right. The seemingly innocent snacks and meals you consume daily might be hiding a grim secret. Today, we're diving deep into a shocking study that could change the way you look at your diet. This isn't just any study, folks. This is a comprehensive analysis conducted in 24 by none other than the British Medical Journal one of the most respected publications in the health and medical field. The study scrutinizes a category of food that's become all too common in our pantry's ultra-processed foods. These are the foods that have been significantly altered from their natural state, packed with additives, preservatives, and artificial ingredients. They're convenient, they're tasty, and they're everywhere. But what's the cost of this convenience and flavor? The British Medical Journal study links ultra-processed foods to serious health risks. We're talking about certain cancers and cardiovascular diseases, and it's not just slight increase in risk. The study points towards a strong connection, which means the more ultra-processed foods you eat, the higher the risk you're putting on your health. This topic is of paramount importance for everyone. Whether you're a health enthusiast trying to optimize your diet, a busy professional relying on quick meals, or a parent concerned about your family's nutrition. But don't worry, we're not just here to frighten you. We're also going to discuss healthier alternatives to ultra-processed foods. One such alternative is the carnivore diet, a diet primarily comprised of meat and animal products. Another is the ketogenic diet, which is a low-carb, high-fat diet. Though they may not be vegetable-heavy, both diets focus on natural, unprocessed foods and can be healthier alternatives to ultra-processed foods. So, are you ready to unveil the truth about what's on our plates, discover the shocking truth about your daily diet, and learn about these healthier alternatives? If you are, then stick around until the end. We're going to delve into which common foods you should avoid, and why embracing diets like the carnivore or ketogenic could be a lifesaver. The knowledge you'll gain today can make a massive difference in your life and health. So let's get started, shall we? In this pivotal study, researchers embarked on a journey to decode the impacts of ultra-processed foods on our health, not just in isolation, but also in reference to other well-known diets such as the carnivore and ketogenic diets. They painstakingly investigated a myriad of prior studies to give a broad understanding of the effects of these foods on our bodies. This method of research is called the Umbrella Review, a strategy that compiles multiple meta-analyses to form a comprehensive understanding of a particular subject. By adopting this method, the researchers were able to compare the connections between ultra-processed foods and chronic diseases with those of the carnivore and ketogenic diets. The result was quite unsettling. The study showed strong links between consumption of ultra-processed foods and an increased risk of chronic diseases, far outweighing any potential risks associated with the carnivore and ketogenic diets. The culprits? Substances like additives, preservatives and artificial ingredients in ultra-processed foods often used to enhance flavor, extend shelf life or alter color and texture. These components, alongside high levels of sugars, salts and unhealthy fats, can wreak havoc on our gut health, igniting inflammation within our bodies, a usual precursor to various chronic illnesses such as certain cancers and cardiovascular diseases. In contrast, the carnivore and ketogenic diets, when followed responsibly, tend to promote reduced inflammation and improved metabolic health. The study doesn't just bring out the risks, it also highlights the scale of these risks. It shows that a higher intake of ultra-processed foods corresponds to a greater likelihood of developing these illnesses compared to adopting the carnivore or ketogenic diets. So what's the takeaway here? The findings offer a clear view of the risks connected with consuming ultra-processed foods versus the carnivore and ketogenic diets. It's a wake-up call prodding us to re-evaluate our dietary choices and lean towards healthier, less processed alternatives for the sake of our well-being. Let's start with this question. What are carnivore and ketogenic diets? Allow me to guide you through these dieting concepts and highlight their differences from diets that rely heavily on ultra-processed foods. The carnivore diet is essentially a zero-carb, all-meat diet. 
Pictureize this, a plate full of juicy steaks, succulent chicken and crispy bacon, with no vegetables or fruits in sight. That, all you carnivore diet enthusiasts, is what your meal generally looks like. On the other hand, ketogenic, or keto diet, involves a high intake of fats, moderate proteins, and very low carbohydrates. Imagine gorging on avocados, cheese nuts, and fatty fish, while keeping your carb intake to a bare minimum. That's the essence of a keto diet. Now, how do these diets differ from those heavy in ultra-processed foods? Let's delve a bit deeper. The carnivore and ketogenic focus on consuming whole, nutrient-dense foods, be it animal products or natural fats. They shun foods that have undergone significant alterations from their original state. Universally, you'll see no shiny foil pouches of apple sauce or vibrant red ketchup bottles, but fresh, unprocessed foods. The ingredient lists are simple, free from long lists of additives, preservatives and artificial ingredients. Unlike ultra-processed foods, these diets don't rely on artificial enhancements of flavor, color or texture. Moreover, these diets are known for their potential health benefits. They avoid the high levels of sugars, salts and unhealthy fats commonly found in ultra-processed foods which are linked to obesity, heart disease, diabetes, high blood pressure and other health issues. Carnivore and ketogenic diets also promote better gut health. They don't disrupt the balance of good and bad bacteria in our gut, a common issue with ultra-processed foods that can lead to bloating, constipation and mood disorders. They also shun artificial ingredients known to cause inflammation in the body, which can lead to serious diseases such as cancer, heart disease and Alzheimer's. So the next time you reach for that packet of instant noodles or can of soda, remember your health could be at stake. Why not consider a juicy steak or a bowl of avocado instead? Let's delve into the foods to steer clear of when following a carnivore or ketogenic diet. These eating plans advocate for whole natural foods and can inherently help avoid the pitfalls of ultra-processed items. Common villains in the world of processed foods include sodas, packaged snacks, reconstituted meats and instant noodles. Sodas are a no-go, chock-full of artificial sweeteners and high-fructose corn syrup. These sugars can spike blood sugar levels, instigate insulin resistance and could lead to type 2 diabetes. Plus, those sodas acids? They're your teeth's worst enemy. Packaged snacks, too, often come with trans fats. These artificial fats tamper with our cholesterol, upping the bad LDL and lessening the HDL, setting the stage for heart disease. Reconstituted meats, such as pre-formed patties and deli slices, are equally guilty with their load of preservatives. Sodium nitrite and sodium nitrate, used to enhance shelf life and color, can form nitrosamines when consumed, compounds suspected to cause certain cancers. And let's not forget the ever-popular instant noodle. A handy hunger solution, but a silent health hazard. They're riddled with sodium and MSG, known culprits for hypertension and a myriad of symptoms in sensitive individuals. Yes, the devil is indeed in the details in this scenario, the ingredients list. Carnivore and ketogenic diets can help you steer clear of these enemies. These diets emphasize nutritious, unprocessed foods, and by focusing on quality meats and healthy fats, you eliminate the risks posed by these harmful ingredients. So next time you're at the grocery store, make a healthier choice. Honor your health by selecting fresh, whole foods instead of that deceptively harmful, ultra-processed item. When shopping, always scrutinize labels, beware of long ingredient lists with tongue-twisting names and keep an eye out for high sugar and fat content. Now ponder about the current contents of your pantry. Are there healthier alternatives? Let's contemplate this. We all have our preferred snacks and comfort foods that we find hard to let go, but are these choices serving our health well? Could we swap these out for something just as flavorsome but more nourishing? As we've explored today, the food we eat significantly impacts our health. Ultra-processed foods often come with a plethora of additives and preservatives, excessive sugar, salt and unhealthy fats, which can be disruptive to our gut health, trigger inflammation and heighten chronic illness risks. Why not gradually introduce healthier options? Maybe it's swapping soda for water with a twist of fresh fruits, or switching a bag of chips with a handful of nuts or crunchy veggies. And for those following carnivorous or ketogenic diets, 
How about replacing processed meats with lean, organically raised options or turning to high-fat, low-carb, nutritious foods like avocados and olives instead of reaching for the high-sugar, low-nutrient processed snacks? The world of healthful foods is far from dull. Picture vivid fruits and vegetables, lean proteins, whole grains and nutritious fats. These foods not only offer vital nutrients but also an assortment of delightful tastes that can satiate your palate. Don't just trust our word, put it to the test. Today, introduce one small dietary change and observe the effects. Healthier choices often result in a more robust body, a clearer mind and an overall enhanced sense of well-being. Remember, this journey need not be solitary. We can learn immensely from each other's experiences. Therefore, we invite you to share your thoughts, hurdles and victories in the comments section below. Do you have a favorite healthy substitute? Or perhaps a tip for bypassing ultra-processed foods? We'd love to hear about it. Kindly share your ideas and strategies for avoiding ultra-processed foods in the comments below. Your stories and tips are always welcome. After all, we're all in this pursuit together, striving for a healthier, more joyful life. In conclusion, bear in mind the power of your decisions at the grocery store, as they can significantly influence your health. We've underscored this reality throughout the video. The foods we eat, notably ultra-processed ones, can greatly affect our well-being, potentially heightening our susceptibility to chronic diseases such as cancer and cardiovascular issues. We've discussed how these ultra-processed foods are packed with additives, preservatives and artificial ingredients, along with high levels of sugars, salts and unhealthy fats that can harm our gut health and trigger inflammation. Common items like sodas, chips, ready-made meats and instant noodles are some of the main offenders. But remember, just because they're convenient doesn't mean we should turn a blind eye to their potential harm. Instead, we need to be more mindful, understanding what we're truly nourishing our bodies with. Rather than focusing solely on calorie count, we should consider the quality of those calories too. This is where diets like the carnivore and ketogenic come into play. Emphasizing whole and minimally processed foods, these diets have shown promising results in promoting better health and reducing the risk of chronic illnesses. It might be a to start, but the benefits are rewarding in the long run, as you prioritize long-term health over short-lived convenience. Remember, you're not alone in this health journey. We're here to provide valuable insights and tips to help you transition into these healthier diets. We urge you to subscribe and click the bell icon so you won't miss out on our future health tips and insights. By doing so, you're not just subscribing to a channel, but to a healthier lifestyle and a community passionate about wellness and conscious living. While it might seem like a small step, it's a huge leap towards the right direction. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. For more insights into healthy eating and wellness, including the benefits of diets like the carnivore and ketogenic, Check out our other videos here on the screen. Stay healthy and see you in the next video.